Okay, so today we're going to look at the next JavaScript and AutoCAD integration sample. And this is looking at generating a view of isometric solids using the isomer JavaScript library in the HTML palette. So what we're going to do here is launch um, the isomer command. This is just bringing up an HTML view. This is a completely non-zoomable static view that's really taken from a single direction from the, the southwest iso isometric um, direction. Um, we're just taking the bounding boxes of existing solids um, and displaying them. Uh, we have a refresh button in case there's a change in the model. So what you know, why don't we go and show that? Oops. Why don't we go and show that here? For example, and we add in a solid and we go and hit refresh. And we see that it gets added there. Similarly, you know, if we do a cylinder, then actually what we'll end up getting is a box because we're really just dealing with with the bounding boxes. We're not dealing with anything more complicated than that. Um, we're using a, a technique to to establish the appropriate order in which to add the solids into the drawing, and that's the distance from the camera, um, assuming a sort of a southwest isometric camera. Um, although actually if you change the, the camera position in the model it'll pick that up instead which is kind of interesting so here if we refresh you'll see the the objects get drawn in a different order um, because the distance from the camera is is different which is which is kind of interesting um, but it does sort of mean that you do need to pay attention to the order in which the the, the, the various solids get added into the, the isomer model so that's the um, the palette view. Uh, we, we close it and then hit the document view. We'll see it's very similar. So you know, you shouldn't expect anything very different from there. Um, similarly, we can go across um, and sort of add in some additional solid geometry here, um, and then go back and refresh. Of course, we we'll see the bounding box again rather than the actual cone. Um, but it's, it's essentially equivalent to the, to the palette view. Okay, thank you.